What's up my dudes, it's Spencer Turley, and today we're going to be checking out my home track compound. Nah, dog, I'm just goofing you, buddy. But really, uh, Spencer makes good videos. He's like top five fastest guys in this game if you want to check him out. Um, I'm really actually jealous that he is on the tough blocks on this BEA beautiful track. This track is insane, and... All other MX Simulator tracks pale in comparison. It is beautiful, dude. But really, though, dog, whose DMs do I have to slide into to be on the tough blocks for the next track? Is it Oprah? Dude, I'll message Oprah. I'll let her know what's up, man. Anyways, the track was made by MX Fish, and I don't know his actual name, but the download link is in the description. And you can actually donate to him, and if you're going to donate to anyone, I think it should be this guy, because clearly a ton of work went into this track. And, um... No. It can't be. Also, my dudes, my name is Sister Tarly, and I'm back. My god. It turns out, Spencer Turley is actually Oprah's son. That bastard. How am I supposed to compete with that? That which is Oprah's son. Of course he can get his name on the tough blocks. He has the upper hand. How am I supposed to compete with that, dude? It's not fair. I mean, fuck, I guess I'll finish the video. <gasps> I'm really not sure how to pronounce the name of the track. It's like Nicholas, except spelt all like European and shit. Like, oh, in Europe we say Niklas, or... I'm just gonna call it Nicholas MX. And if you didn't know, this guy has actually made a motocross track before the supercross track. And it's sick too, it looks really good, but I don't think it looks as good as the Supercross track. And I don't think it was as fun. Um, this is just like, this track is the shit really, it's insane. So I'm gonna fuck off and put on the Turtle Beaches, so you can experience full screen erotica of this track. Here's one of my favorite sections. Like I said, this track isn't just pretty, and it functions very well as a track. It has multiple lines, it's really fun. And it has this cool hybrid section, which is a nice change of pace from those copy and paste sections we see every single week in Supercross. Of course, this wouldn't be a proper track review without a hot lap. Am I right or am I right? So I'm gonna throw down a heater while I discuss a few more points about what makes this track so perfect. This is honestly one of my favorite rhythm sections of all time. You can quad out, then you got this transfer. I mean, I really can't think of anything that the guy fucked up on. Everything on this track is sick. When I try to imagine someone creating a masterpiece like this, I'd like to tell myself that it's just like Spongebob writing an essay. Because if it were me personally making anything that resembled this track, it would take me hours on hours and days on end until I'd made like one, I don't know, whoop section or one rhythm section hell to create one decal. So then a week would pass and I'd look at my straightaway that I finished and it would just be like, the, uh, I'm going to go ahead and quit. On a side note, check out this sick line that I found. It's probably my crowning achievement of being an MX simulator player. So I jumped through the, those tough blocks. I thought that was pretty cool. There was a cool line I did earlier, but I just completely stole that from Hunter Root. And um, I'm pretty proud that I found that one that I just showed y'all. And like everything else, the sand section is perfected. It feels like natural sand somehow, and sand berms are different than the ruts on the rest of the track. Throw a big whip -a for that 103 lap time. I'm really not sure if that's good. It's probably not. I'm not that great at this game. So that's a heater on the best track of all time, and here's what Ryan Dungey has to say about that. Oh, 
there, Ryan. Oh, yeah, you're famous. I used to own a TTR-125 back in the day. How do you feel about that? Yeah, I'm just going to take a race by race, and, you know, at the end of the day, you know, it's just a dirt bike race. Oh, right. You sure sound like a bitch. So what happened out there? Well, I was riding my own race, you know, after getting passed by Tomac, and then I was whoop de doing through those whoopies. And then Spencer Turley came out What's of nowhere and just took me dudes? out, man. Hey, Sister Turley and oh, you mean Oprah's son? Hey, you guys talking about Spencer Turley? Oh, yeah. Dude's a legend. <laughs> we like to have fun around here.